I'm Shane Narbonne. I ride the number 64 Yamaha R6. Scott Greer, rider of the number 4 Yamaha, sponsored by Dunlop Tires and Argo Cycles. How's it going? Sam Greenwood, ride the number 2 Yamaha R6 here at the uh, Niemer Racing Series. Well, uh, being from New Hampshire, Loudoun Classic is uh, kind of the, the pinnacle race that we have here in the Northeast Road Racing Series uh, for motorcycle racing. So yeah, it means a lot to us. Um, I've won it a few times. I'd like, to win it. I'd like to win it again. So, you know, trying to put our best effort forward for it, for sure. Uh, the Loudoun Classic means to me, uh, I mean, it's the oldest race in America, and I'm actually one of the youngest ones to ever win it. Uh, so it's, 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 a, it's actually a big race for me. I actually come up here once a year and race it, so uh, I'm the all-time winner of it, and uh, it's, it's probably one of the best races I do uh, in my career, to be honest. Uh, Loudoun Classic is uh, obviously part of our regular series that we run up here um, in New Hampshire, but uh, Loudoun Classic, to me, um, it's a little more than that. I've obviously grown up, watched this race, uh, God, probably for the past uh, 18 to 20 years. Um, I've seen my dad win it a few times. I've seen uh, a lot of crazy stuff happen over the years and the past couple years racing in it, it's been pretty cool. So a lot of classic to me um, is something that I've dreamed of winning uh, since I was a little kid. So um, it's definitely something we do get excited for. Um, 20 laps is, is a long race. Um, I don't run any GTs or anything like that. So it makes it interesting. Um, but. The goal is to, to try not to get too excited about it, just go out and ride, and uh, we'll see what happens at the end. Uh, I mean, the plan tomorrow, of course, uh, today you have to race in a middleweight GP for the dash today to qualify for tomorrow for the position, so you always want to be at least on the front row. And then uh, as for tomorrow, you want to uh, just get a decent start. And just uh, as for me, I, I just got to pace myself off the other guys. and. Uh, the biggest thing to me is uh, you only have to go so fast to win the race. Uh, you don't have to break any track records or anything like that. So uh, uh, win the race for uh, the pace you have to go. So uh, to win the Loudon Classic is going to you know take a lot of things and take a really really good start, a bunch of clean laps, uh, selecting the right tire for the longer race. Um, you know, 20 laps versus the normal eight that we normally do around here. Uh, so there'll be some some fatigue uh, and uh, maybe some mistakes made. So it's really important to have a clean race. Uh, the classic, uh, with it being 20 laps, there's a lot of strategy involved. Um, there's always a, the big variables. You never know what's going to happen with red flags and stuff like that. Uh, obviously, the past couple of years, weather has played a huge part in that. Uh, but this year, it's looking like it's going to be sunny. Um, so a big thing is uh, obviously tire preparation. Make sure you've got the correct amount of fuel. You're not carrying too much, but make sure you've got enough to get you through all 20 laps. Um, and then after that, it's really uh, obviously try to get a good start and uh, try to pace yourself. Uh, for me, I'm not in the greatest shape, so 20 laps is a lot of laps. Uh, so I got to make sure that uh, I can try to get out front with those guys and go with them, but make sure that I still have something in the tank towards the end of the race so I don't fade off. Uh, I got to say a big thanks to Pirelli Tires for coming on board this year. Uh, it's a big challenge for me, uh, but it's fun. Uh, Lenny from KTEC. Uh, with, with the suspension is awesome. Woodcraft, my dad, Narbonne, Concrete, um, 60 helmets. There's just so many guys, and uh, just gotta thank my whole family too. So.